Come on, Ella. It's been four months. I need to start seeing progress from your side. I know you may feel stuck, but this is a safe space. I had a dream again. The dream of... It was a dream! S sorry. I saw them. Both of them. I can still feel the way one of them tucked my hair back. The way his disgusting fingers traced my face. I can hear them speak. I feel it all. That's a common symptom the stress and trauma has caused you. You're still trying to process everything in your mind. Oh, I am so sorry. I got sent up here to clean the offices, but clearly they made some kind of mistake. That's fine. But please knock next time even if you think the office is empty. Right. I want to try something. Do you think we could go back to the very beginning? I know it's hard a lot to ask for, but I really believe you can dig deeper. I guess so. Would you try something for me? I want you to close your eyes and visualise the room of the two men. Lovely. Now take a deep breath in. And out. And with each countdown from ten, I want you to feel your memory go deeper. Ten. Nine. Should we provide her with some water? <laughs> Perhaps you're right. She needs a little hydration after that rough drive. Get some water for the van. That's better. 
the fuck down. She speaks. Drink. <laughs> Open a <her> fucking mouth. <laughs> I said I don't <sighs> want it. The other man, his name, his name, his name was Chicago. He was Chicago, and and he he had a tattoo, and it was like it was like it, it was like a, a, a spiral, but in a sun. And they never say their names. They they, they never said their names, and and, and they they said and they they said it. They. I, I remember. Session. Very good, thanks. How are you feeling after last session? You made huge progress. You should be proud. Fine, I guess. I'm. Well, I mean, hostage survivors can experience different stress and emotions from trauma. I mean, for you, it's intrusive thoughts, anxiety, confusion, and most importantly, impaired memory. The important thing is we're going to keep working together. Yeah. I'm just struggling to cope. I, I just want to remember everything. Well, you were. This is a long process, and you need to have patience. I don't have any fucking patience left in me, okay? Sorry. It's okay. I, I didn't mean that. Mm. Have you been taking your medication recently? I... Oh, sorry. Look, I'm lying. I'm Adeline. sorry, I, I... I... I've been feeling a lot of... Um, I, I just don't feel like myself when I take them. Then you need to take them. I had another dream. Day six. I was still tied up in a chair and they entered. And I could still hear them sniggering. <laughs> it was so disgusting. So dirty. It was sickening. Wakey, wakey, princess. Time to wake up. <laughs> Please let me go. <laughs> Please. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fun little bird. Fun. Phoenix. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? So because you've been such a good girl, we'll untie these. <laughs> Shut it. Listen to Chicago. We'll untie these, and you follow every order we give you. Understood? Good.
good. Walk over to the bed. Quick, I'm going to hold it. Move. Now. Take your top off. It froze. I couldn't move. My feet were glued to that wooden floor. My heart was racing and my throat was dry. You, you had a knife? You, you had a knife tucked in the side of his trousers and I noticed it as the days went by that he carried it at all times. Here. Take it off. Ah! Oh. 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 I, I killed him. I stabbed him. I killed a man. I, I denial, denial. Of course, how could I not seen this before? She's she's been in denial this entire time. Oh, unbelievable. The, the, what humans can keep as a result of trauma. Doctor Dixon, please. I, 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 I to continue this conversation with our next session. I, 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 please, I, I, please. I'll walk you to the door. I think we should. I think we should book another session. Problem.